What's up, my nuggets? Mr. Phantasmo here today. What? Free for uh do I ever say today? I need I need cue cards or something. S Sarah! Can we get the cue cards written up so I know how to introduce my own videos? She must be on her lunch break. I don't know. Everybody at the office is just completely off their gosh dang rockers all the time. Um, anyways, guys, what's new with you? Obviously, nothing's changed with me. Still get completely annihilated at the beginning of every match. You know, I've just grown. I've grown to be excited if I get if I if I just have a rough start to a Call of Duty match because um, I know I know I'm just I'm just bound for greatness after that. You know, it's only uphill from there unless it's not. That's what I. That's what I. That's what I love to live and live and live and let live by. So today we're playing. A nice little free-for-all match with the P90. What? On Dome? What? Using a specialist bonus? What? I don't really think you use a specialist. Oh, yeah, you do. It's a specialist uh, killstreak package or something. I don't know. It's been forever since I... And this guy. Oh, I feel sorry for this guy. That guy right there, that dead corpse, is going to reanimate itself and continuously run into my bullets over and over again. I, I honestly think uh, this lobby as a whole was... Was a little a little new, or maybe just getting back into the game. Like I was watching this earlier, and just how I move and how I'm how I'm I don't know. It, it just seems like maybe I'm getting back into the game. I don't know why I'm hip firing all the time. I hip fire a lot. I, I don't know if I was going for some sort of challenge or something. Knowing me, that little rascal in my brain always wants to go for go for those challenges. But um, yeah. So maybe maybe he was just new. Maybe he was just getting reacclimated to the game. Um, it always takes me uh, a, a few matches or so, or maybe even a, a day or two, depending on how long how long I uh, step off of the horse. You know, it's just like riding a it's just like riding a bike, um, except for it's not. Call of Duty is, is absolutely nothing like riding a bike. It's more like uh, you know d uh, teaching a Tyrannosaurus Rex not to not to eat uh, human flesh. And you, how long does it take for that to happen? It takes it takes an extra. First of all, it takes an extremely long amount of time in the beginning. This guy, see, you see what I mean? He just and he and he keeps spawning like in this building. He's just he would he's like my first test subject that I would feed to the Tyrannosaurus Rex to to uh, you know to make sure that he knows that. And then after he after he took a bite of his arm, I'd be like no, and I I tap him on the I tap him on the snout with my finger. I say no, T, no, and and he'd kind of like groan and growl and roar or whatever sound that he would make, and then. I know that if I if I feed that guy to him, that he'll just come alive again, and he'll wander right back into me, all innocent, and and he trusts me. And then I'll just I'll, I'll use this I'll, I'll use another arm and maybe a leg or a toe, and you you gotta wean him off of the meat, and and you know maybe feed him like a lot of beans or cauliflower, make their make their skin texture kind of greasy and nasty, and then you wean off the dinosaur. But eventually, if he steps away and if he's allowed to do whatever he wants again, you know it's it's gonna be a lot harder to uh, prime away from that human. When it when it comes down to you know two weeks or or maybe even more so there's all um, I know you guys come here for for the just the up tempo and and on point analogies and that's what I just try to bring to you over and over again I just is there dust in this room I have never noticed that until I just looked and there is there is actually particle dust in in on the screen right now I don't know. I don't know if I'm just seeing things, but that is just glorious. These graphics are just phenomenal. This brand new game game from this this new gameplay that I'm bringing you guys, you should check this out. It ha it's, the game's not out yet, but when this game comes out, it's gonna be it's gonna be off the charts. What was that? Was that a steady aim challenge or something? I don't know. Um, anyways, I don't know why I was thinking about dust. Maybe it, maybe it's because these allergies, man. I can't handle these allergies anymore, and I'm starting. To uh, well, I, I actually handle them pretty well. Um, in the in the beginning, in the in, in the beginning of the day is when it's the worst. I hate allergies when I wake up, because that's the only time I'll wake up and my eyes will be watering and I'll think I'll be like, oh my god, and then my nose will just be watering and everything just waters in the beginning. There's water coming out of my ears and every time I try to speak, it's just like a fountain. And uh, I'm on my bike riding to class and I'm stopped at a traffic light and I gotta like. I gotta whip out my hanky and I gotta blow blow a big rag snot in there and then this this old mom in her minivan is just checking me out like what is this guy doing and then I just like fling it on her window and drive away. No, I don't do that, but uh, instead she she like rolls down her window to yell at me and I smash it in her car and then I drive away. And uh, that's not true either. So, anyways, I don't know. 
these allergies, man, they kill me. And then today, like today, I was walking, I was walking to class, and I, I don't know why, but I just think I walk faster than a lot of people because I'm always passing people. Um, I also think that I, I breathe really heavy when I walk, but I can't tell because I'm listening to music and I'm just jamming. I'm just like, <laughs> I probably look like a complete roid freak without all the muscles. I just, I have the breathe pattern of a roid rage addict. And uh, so I was walking past this guy, and right as I was about to pass him, as I was like in his blind spot. Um, I sneezed because I had to sneeze and I, and I sneezed really loud. I've sneezed on a lot of commentaries before, but it, it pretty much sounds like a cough, but it sounds like an exaggerated cough sneeze. I don't know how to explain it other than that. Um, and I sneezed because I was still in my allergy mode and the guy like looked back at me and, and it really freaked him out. Like, I don't even think I must've not have been breathing, uh, roid, roid like, um, on, on this particular day, but he looked back and he was like, Oh my God. And he didn't really say anything, but he just kind of looked at me. And, and at that point I just looked at him and was like, I don't know what you want me to do. And then, you know, I ran up, I just ran away. I ran up ahead of him and I, and I, uh, chased down a squirrel and I, and I killed it and I bit its head off and I brought him back to him as a souvenir and a trophy and a sign of peace. And, uh, then we were friends, and we went and we went and grabbed some uh, we went and grabbed some chips and fish, and I uh, didn't even go to class. So because it was that great of a friendship, and I could just tell it was going to be everlasting. So um, there's that. Um, yeah, that's it. That's all I have for you today. Oh, gonna be more prison architect. I know there's probably somebody has already put in the comments more prison. I want you to take me to prison. Come shackle me and take me to your fantasy world. Uh, where you torture individuals, and I will do more of that. Um, as you can see, I haven't even had time to play uh, any Black Ops, hence the gameplay. Also, I have a lot of this backed up. Uh, I just went through. I was like, oh, don't have any more Black Ops, but I, I got a, I just got a, a load of Call of Duty. I uh, probably got a lot of like weird Moab gameplay like this. If you, if that's, if that's up your alley, so let me know. Um, I have an exam tomorrow, so I have to study a lot tonight. Probably won't get a Prison Architect out tonight, unless, for some reason. I do. So, anyways, um, look forward to that probably this weekend, and I will see you guys tomorrow. I love you. Peace, Nuggets. That's kind of weird. <laughs>